Welcome to our video guide for Key Stage 4 Accountability and Progress 8 for Schools in England. This is video guide 2 of 5, the new point system. Video guides 3 of 5 explain calculating Progress 8 with work examples. If you need more help, we've provided contact details of curriculum and policy experts you can talk to at the end of the video. The three principles underpinning the change are aimed at ensuring the point system is simpler than it is now and increases the differential between the points for low grades and high grades in order to better reward high performance. The new point system translates into much simpler points profile with equal incentive to push up all grades. With Progress 8 replacing 5 A star to C's as the floor standard, this removes an overemphasis on the C stroke D grade borderline. The BTEC grading has been added so you can see how this fits in. Two main points to note. The cliff edge at the bottom has disappeared. Under the old point scale you lost 16 points for each grade U, almost cancelling out three grades of improvement by other students. The differential between the points for a grade G and an A star has been increased from about three and a half times, 16 to 58, to eight times to encourage schools to push students to higher grades. If you need more advice about Progress 8 you can contact your Curriculum Development Manager or Curriculum Support Consultant at www.btech.co.uk support. Sign up for our Policy Watch updates at policywatch.edxl.com or talk to your subject advisor in the Teaching Services team. 